Spermatogenesis is the biological process of sperm development that occurs within the testicles. To start the process, specialized germ cells within the testes divide mitotically to produce spermatogonia. Shown here is a single spermatogonium. Spermatogonia have a complete set of chromosomes. As you can see in the illustration, this particular organism has four chromosomes in total, two from each parent, and so are considered diploid. Eventually, this number will be halved once a sperm cell is produced, so expect to see sperm cells with two chromosomes only. Furthermore, there are two types of spermatogonia formed, type A and type B. Type B is the one we're interested in, because it goes on to divide mitotically to produce primary spermatocytes, while type A acts as a reserve for future sperm development. Before the primary spermatocyte enters the first stage of meiosis, its DNA is replicated. Notice how the primary spermatocyte has eight chromosomes in total. That's double what it had originally. Meiosis is a type of cell division that reduces the number of chromosomes in a cell before reproduction, and it requires that the cell double its chromosomes first. After the first meiotic division, two secondary spermatocytes are produced. The secondary spermatocytes divide again in the second stage of meiosis resulting in four haploid spermatids. See how the cells all have two chromosomes, while the spermatogonium at the beginning had four. Spermatids must go through a maturation process after they complete meiosis in order for them to become viable sperm, also known as spermatozoa. Sperm production occurs throughout the reproductive life of human males, and testes produce 200 to 300 million spermatozoa daily.